Jen, that was a tough match. That was very tough. She's a tenacious opponent. How'd you find it? Yeah, obviously she's a really good player and a big hit. Especially, I think she had a very strong serve. Um, that was difficult for me. And then we both had a great tennis here. Especially in the first set, you know, I had some chance in my service game. But in that moment, uh, I couldn't get it. And match goes on. And I start to feel better and better. Uh, I'm really happy to play here. And I won the first round, even it's so difficult. And thanks for the crowd who supported me here. That was amazing. <laughs> You're coming off a career best season. What do you look forward to in 2024? Where is your belief at going into this year? Well, I always believe everything could happen, but I try to say to myself, don't have too much pressure. Just, you know, it's tennis, round by round, match by match. You can't think too far. So right now, I will just say focus on the moment and let's enjoy here to play in Melbourne. I have to... I have to go back in time just for a moment. I have to go back 10 years ago because in 2014, a lady by the name of Lee Na won here at the Australian Open. How great of a role model has she been for you? Well, time passed so fast. I don't even realize it's already 10 years. I remember I used to see her match. I remember that final because I see more than 10 times that video. You know, Lina, she's obviously an amazing player and then she's uh, the goal of all the Chinese player. And yeah, she had a great performance here and let's see what will happen this year. She had all the support of China. I get the feeling you've got all the support of China as well. If tonight is anything to go by, Jen, congratulations. We look forward to seeing you in the second round. Thanks so much, and thanks again to all the crowds. Thank you, guys. Thank you, fans. Thank you.